or it is cold outside. And I don't know about y'all, but something that's pretty good to pair with the cold weather that we've got Charday is some hot coffee. And it looks like we've got a coffee truck that's pulled into the news station. Man, Chandler, yes, we do have a coffee truck that's pulled up to the morning loop. A great way to jumpstart our morning for sure. Now, I am joined here by Ann with, she's the owner, actually, operator of yes. Esprizio. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. My pleasure. Thank you for having us. Well, okay, so let's get... I wanted to say jump started again, but I'm trying to think of other play on the words. Let's get this a uh, segment brewing. <laughs> I know I haven't even <laughs> tried my coffee. I'm gonna try it in a minute. But and kind of tell me why a coffee food truck. Well, about four and a half years ago, I had a business partner and we together we were both homeschool moms looking for something to supplement our income. So we found this company for sale and we only started with our indoor catering section um, and then about middle of 19, uh, 2019, we decided to add the trailer to kind of supplement and we launched it January 2020, right before COVID shut down and we lost all of our indoor catering. So this is kind of what, what saved us. But recently I um, bought my partner out after four years and now I'm the sole owner and I have several girls that come and help me. Awesome. What a really, really great story. Okay. So tell me how has business been? I know, you know, a lot of people survived through the pandemic, but um, do people really like the food truck, coffee food truck concept? It's very different for us. Um, we can't compare ourselves to other food trucks because we are exclusively coffee. Um, so it is can be hit or miss for us. Um, a lot of times people think coffee and only cold weather, but we do have a lot of cold drinks available. We have a full menu of hot and ice drinks throughout the whole entire year. And then we feature different drinks um, monthly or seasonally as well. So it's been, it's been slow at times, and then we have other things where we really love to do is get out in the community. Um, we have our indoor catering events. We have our catering from the trailer. That's what we really focus on is our special events, our offices, our schools, um, corporate um, parties, weddings. I have a wedding tomorrow, so oh. we love to go out and just engage with the community a lot more than just handing someone a, a, piece of, a cup of coffee or a yeah. piece of snack to go with it. Yeah. That's where we like to make our connections in the community. Them, warming the hearts out there. Now, I do have a question for you. Um, do you uh, travel all across East Texas or do you stay in a particular city? Great question. We do mostly stay with the trailer inside Smith County just for permit purposes. Um, catering, we go slightly out. It's allowed things that way. Mm -hmm. um, our indoor catering, we go all over East Texas. We have um, events with the, um, the blood Carter Blood Care. Yes. We do a lot of their banquets and stuff all over Waco, Paris. I mean, we go all over East Texas with our indoor catering. All right, well, it is cold out here, and you have actually made some fantastic drinks for our crew. Um, I'm going to taste mine. I got the caramel macchiato. Yeah. I feel really fancy this morning <laughs> with it, and it smells lovely, so let me get my first sip. Okay. The best cup of coffee you've ever had in East Texas. Wind me up! <laughs> I love it. It is amazing, and I'm honestly not exaggerating. It is really good. Um, what did you make Chandler? I feel like his drink is over here. Which one's his? Um, here, this one is our iced mocha, peppermint mocha. Then these are our natural um, plant-based energy drinks that we have available. Okay. And then we have other mocha lattes. We have our caramel pumpkin. We just kind of finished that off for the fall season, but it's still ordered on our secret menu. Yes. Our regulars know what's available still. Okay. So um, I'm going to run one of these coffees into Chandler, so hopefully he can enjoy it. Absolutely. Um, but for now, I'm just in studio.